I'm Diane Kochilis, a Greek-American chef and cookbook author, consulting chef at four restaurants in New York City and across the country, and the owner of the glorious Greek cooking school on my native island, Ikaria, in Greece, of course, in the Aegean. It's a wonderful place. I'm going to show you how to make spaghetti with brown butter and feta cheese today, with a little twist of my own. I have my basic ingredients here. The main ingredient is feta cheese, Greek feta, of course, which is a sheep's milk cheese or a sheep and goat's milk cheese. And I've crumbled about two and a half cups of it, and that will be for about a pound of spaghetti. I want to talk to you a little bit about the spaghetti because I chose a very traditional Greek spaghetti today. What's unique about it is that it's quite thick, and there's a little bit of a hole in the center. It's almost like a straw. It, it's a one, it looks wonderful when you cook it up. It's really a lot more interesting than plain old spaghetti. You can make this, however, with just regular spaghetti. I have my butter here, which I'm going to cook slowly and brown. And I'm going to add a little bit of extra virgin Greek olive oil, only because I, I can't cook without extra virgin Greek olive oil. And this is one of my favorite olive oils. It's from Western Crete from the area of Kolimbari, and it's called terra creta. This will go on right at the end, just as a little bit of a garnish almost, a flavor added right at the end. It's really green and fruity, and it's a wonderful combination with all of this. And a little bit of black pepper, just to add some spice, some bite. I've got my water boiling. I'm gonna add my sort of thick Greek tubular spaghetti to the water. It's gonna take about, this takes a little bit longer than regular spaghetti to cook up. It'll take about, 10 to 12 minutes. So this is salted water, boiling pretty robustly. And while that's happening, I'm going to brown my butter. Butter that's gonna melt and color. The beauty of brown butter, what we want is that nutty flavor. That's what browning it is all about. That will cook down and it will take a few minutes for it to turn color. Okay, my pasta's ready. I'm gonna get it off the stove and drain it. Okay, I'm gonna get my pasta in here in layers. This is the traditional Greek way of doing this and this was Always something that came on Sundays. You ate this on Sundays, usually with some sort of uh, nice roasted chicken or some lamb. I'm going to strain some of my browned butter through here. Get a little bit of my feta in here. This is really Greek comfort food. I'm going to basically keep doing that until this serving bowl is filled up. And the idea is that the feta melts between the layers of hot pasta and melted butter, and you get this nutty, delicious, easy comfort food. I am going to add a little bit of olive oil to this, some browned butter, some more of my feta, a bit more olive oil. I'm going to get a little bit of pepper in here. That's to my liking. That's my little tweak. The whole idea is that the feta melts between the layers of pasta and what you get is a very, very nice comfort meal that's really easy and perfect for a weekend afternoon. One last I, you know, pouring of this beautiful brown butter. I don't want to get any of the burnt part in there. A little bit of my Cretan extra virgin olive oil, terra creta from Colimbari. This is Greek mother's comfort food. Pasta with feta and brown butter. And my twist on it, a little bit of extra virgin Greek olive oil and that thick Greek spaghetti. Again, you could use any spaghetti with this. It's wonderful, it's easy, it's Greek, it's hearty, and kids love it. I'm Diane Kochilis, chef and author, consulting chef at four Greek restaurants in the United States, and the owner of the Glorious Greek Cooking School on my native island, Ikaria. Enjoy.